Hey guys, so today I want to take you through a rig from a woman's perspective. I know Corey likes to start his videos on the outside. I really love to check out the inside of these RVs. So today we're the Tampa RV Show and we are looking at a Grand Design Imagine XLS 23LDE model. So I hope you'll stick around. Come on in. So I will warn you, it is windy and rainy. So if my feet are squeaking or we head outside for a minute and it's windy, pardon the weather. Um, but anyway, we're starting in the kitchen and I love the huge window in the back. Um, how great is it if you do have to wash dishes that you actually have a nice view and it really helps the lighting too. So the more windows in an RV, the more I love it. Alright, so if you've watched a video where I've chimed in, you know I love storage and this camper utilizes any extra space for storage. Lots of cabinets, drawers, deep drawers too. Um, you know, even little spaces under the sink and a shoe cubby. I love a shoe cubby. Don't track in the dirt, drop your shoes and toss them in there out of the way. And check it out, there's even some great drawers right here by the door. So you will not run out of space to store your things in this camper. All right, so moving on over, I wanted you to see the pantry. I love that there's a deep shelf, but you don't have to shove everything in there. If you wanted to organize things a little differently, you have options with these drawers. I think that's pretty awesome. All right, 10 cubic foot fridge. That's really big for this size unit. So just wanted to point that out. Plenty of uh, space there for your food. And then I love, this is a, to me, a little larger than normal. It's not your typical two-person theater seat. You've got a larger um, three-person couch, seated couch here. But my favorite part of the couch, and this is essential to me in an RV, is I can sit on the couch and the TV is directly across. I don't have to turn my head. It is right in front of me. So that's a big deal. I love that about this camper. And I also think having a place to dine, I don't always want to sit on the couch and eat. So as a couple... I would certainly love having a place to sit and enjoy my meal. Okay, we're moving in the bathroom and it has a window. So you know I love natural light in a camper. This is great. And as a female who has hair appliances, there is some really great space under this cabinet. This is huge to me for a um, RV bathroom cabinet. So I really love that about this unit. Um, and then this is always great. We roll up our towels and put them in these cubbies. So I, I always think this is like a genius way to utilize that space. Um, and tons of floor space. I love the walkthrough bathroom. It's one of my favorites because there's so much room. You don't feel like you're getting out of the shower and having to kind of maneuver around or squish around. So love the space in here. And then this is pretty me. It's pretty timeless bedroom setup. These are full residential size queens, y'all, so not a, a smaller size, but for this Imagine XLS, there are still residential queens in these units. Um, and of course, your, your typical storage, your hanging storage, um, but great utilization of this space. And of course, you got your window here and you have a door. So if you needed to um, come in and out of just the bedroom and didn't want to track all the way through the camper, you could do that. All right, we'll wrap up with the exterior. It's not as important to me. That's kind of Corey's wheelhouse, but um, I do want my camper to look good. And I think the gray, the white, and the black that is on these Imagines is just slick and it's timeless, right? And it has the new Imagine logo. Of course, ours has the original logo, which we love, but this new logo is pretty awesome. So wanted you guys to see that and just see the, the lines, the timeless color to me. All right, y'all, it is windy and cold here in Tampa, so I'm gonna wrap this up. I wanna hear from you. You've heard what's essential to me, what I love about an RV, uh, what I need on the inside. So tell me, ladies, what is your must-have? What do you love to see on the interior of an RV? And guys, tell us what your lady likes to see in an RV. I'd love to see those comments. So hop in the comment section, let us know. Thanks for watching, and please consider subscribing if you're not already subscribed.